Okay, May 6, year 2009. I'm trying to uh, fix my vintage oscilloscope. I guess this is uh, more than 25 years old uh, oscilloscope, the Trio. Okay, and I found out the two uh, capacitors is defective. Let me show you uh, the defective capacitor. There, this is the defective capacitor. This is a voltage doubler capacitor. It's a 0.1 microfarad, 1000 volts. So the two, the two capacitors have open circuit circuit. That's why I can produce a very high voltage. Now it's very difficult to get this kind of capacitor. It's a 1000 volts, 0.1. The nearest I can get is uh, this uh, mylar capacitor. This is 0.1. Uh, this uh, there. This uh, 0.1 microfarad, 630 volts. Okay, this is the nearest I can get. But by using a series parallel connection, I can uh, convert this capacitor into a uh, 0.1 volt, 0.1 microfarad, 1,200 volts. Okay, if you sh if you connect two capacitor in series, then you increase the capacitance. So if you, okay, uh, so 0.1. Point 0.1 connected in two parallel will become a point 0.2. Then you connect two point 0.2 par in parallel, then it will become point 0.1 again. <laughs> but you increase the voltage rating. Okay. So this is how I did. Okay. There I use four capacitor for each. Uh, yeah, there. One electrolytic capacitor is replaced by four pieces mylar capacitor connected in series and parallel. This will give you the same result. It's a the effective capacitor will be be 0.1 microfarad, 1,200 volts. Okay. So when I turn on this oscilloscope and measure the voltage across the two capacitor, it's 600 volts and 600 volts. Okay. When you measure this, uh, the bigger capacitor here. And the, the voltage is 1,200 and 1,200. Okay. I guess this will uh, last, uh, mylar capacitors is, uh, will last longer because there's no electrolyte inside. Okay. Bought it from Deco for only 80 pesos for 10 pieces. Okay, so let me assemble it. I'll uh, show you, uh, I'm sure it will work. Because uh, before, I just measure only 400 volts. But now, I was able to measure it 1,200 volts. Okay, so let's see. By the way, uh, I was able, luckily, I was able to download the, the schematic diagram through the internet. It's in the PDF format. So, for you guys, I will just uh, for, scan it for you through my this uh, video camera. Okay, so this is uh, the whole view. Then, I will make a close-up view. So you don't have to download it. Maybe you can read it through my uh, there. I will scan it slowly. Okay, so you don't have to download it through the internet by just watching my video so this is the power supply there you can see the two capacitor the voltage doubler so there this is the voltage doubler capacitor okay right that's a two voltage doubler capacitor with the two diode okay the primary is 500 volts the transformer is 0 to 500 volts and the doubler become 1000 volts Okay, uh, let me scan it for you. Okay. There. Okay, the, the other way around, uh, there. This save you from uh, downloading from the internet. 
maybe you can just watch this video and perform a start stop on the video stroll bar there <laughs> Anyway, you can download it for free. So this is the, the first page. Trio. There, that's my model. It's the same family as my uh, signal generator. There's Trio. Okay, so let me assemble it and show you how it looked like. 